Since I'm nine years old, I've been dreaming of Porsche. This brand is the reason why I became a car designer. Now I'm here in China, one of the most important markets for the automotive industry. And only here, here in Shanghai, it was possible for me to meet the right people to create the rebirth of an icon. My name is Alain Rosier. I'm 28 years old and I'm a car designer currently working for a Chinese brand. My boss is so cool that he allowed me to spend a lot of my free time working for another brand, which I'm passionate about. The Porsche 908 Long Hague from 1968 and this car, the 917, are the reason of all this. I fell in love with the shape. I wanted to somehow create a modern version of it. We were four people working on this project uh, from the same company. And obviously during the day, we would work uh, on our paid job. But then at night, when all the others would go back home, we would stay and switch on the Porsche 908 project. And uh, we spent almost two years. My name is Marcos Beltrão. I am 30 years old. In this project, I'm working as the modeler, and uh, the modeler mission is to take the designer input as a sketch, as a verbal input or examples from other cars, and uh, translate this intention to 3D surfaces. My name is uh, Guillermo Migno. I'm a French uh, interior car designer. I came to Shanghai roughly two years ago. And that's when I met uh, Alan. They started working on this personal projects after work in the evenings. And they asked me if I wanted to join to create the, the interior for that car, which I obviously uh, accepted because it looked like a really fun project. Right next to our office, there is this shop where a friend of ours works and they work on like really crazy, nice uh, sports car. They happen to have some clients which have GT3 RS and uh, 918, which are two important cars uh, for us. These cars were just perfect to us to get uh, inspiration, to feel in real the, the DNA of Porsche, how they treat the surfaces, and we could take that and translate in our model. Eight months ago, I remember we were working with Marcos on the car at night and I just checked my email and I saw that Porsche wrote us. At some stage we never got the approval from Porsche or from anybody. Actually I was a bit afraid to open it and when we started to read we couldn't believe it. Like We went so crazy because many people told me that Maybe I could get trouble with the brand actually, using their name and their property. And they were actually uh, thankful and, and really happy. So for us, it was the best reward we could get. We never expected that uh, Porsche as a company would, would, would contact us and say, hey guys, cool, uh, that's nice, why not? Of course, as a designer, uh, I have a lot of expectations. I hope that all the highlights, the care in the details and the surfaces will be transferred in this model. So I, I cannot wait to see it. Yeah, I'm really proud uh, because this is, this is a project that I had in mind for so long. And, and finally today, we are able to show it and and the quality of it is is more 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 above that everything that i could expect it's even more than just a project that we do even for work for every day because it's really it's something different where we put really our own like passion on it it's not like this time even though we were we had porsche in mind we were really working for us like really like what was our vision what was really the thing that we wanted to do We have been trying to count 
how much time we spend on this car. And we roughly came up with 5,000 hours. But at the end, it doesn't matter because we've never did it for the money or for anything else. We, we've done it for the passion.